It's gonna be incredible. Have you ever been around somebody who asks how you're doing, and then when you get ready to tell them how you're doing, they've already moved on? Sometimes you're checking that box of like minimum kindness or something. You're, you've got things on your minimum mind. Minimum kindness. You've got stuff to do. <laughs> and what is minimum kindness? I think a lot of people get caught up with their day and they think they're very important. They got to get to there and I've done it to their email and their text and they don't have time for a long conversation. They don't necessarily want the uh, detailed answer back. <laughs> minimum kindness. They toured with Fugazi, if I'm not mistaken. <laughs> yeah, they play Bonnaroo. Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, minimum kindness. Yeah. Could you pretty much make a Liam Neeson movie out of all walks of life. Let's say sports radio host by day, murderer by night, and we call it dead air. Boom. Fritzy, give me your Liam Neeson. I will find you, I will hunt you down, and I will kill you. <laughs> Sean Salisbury, host of the Sean Salisbury Show. Every time I come on, there's this there's this introduction. You said dead air, and then Sean's coming on here. <laughs> hey, listen to me, Dan. I have a particular set of skills. If you talk about my career and how bad it was, I will find you. <laughs> it's still one of the great stories ever when we were in New Orleans and we ran into Mitch Kupchak of all people. And Sean Salisbury was never more excited. Sean would always say, uh, GM of the Lakers. And then you'd always have somebody say, Mitch Kupchak. And then he would hit you in the groin, give you a cup check. And all of a sudden we're there. And Mitch Kupchak walks in. And he walks up to Mitch, and then I, I think he says, oh, God, who's the Lakers GM? And he goes, me, Mitch Kupchak. And he gives him a <laughs> Kupchak. And I went, oh, my God, he just did it. <laughs> Doug Gottlieb, former college basketball player. We have we brought a basketball hoop over here, and uh, McLovin went out there as well. McLovin played junior varsity at Dartmouth. And uh, Doug, of course, one of the uh, all-time leading assist men in college basketball history. Uh, had some issues from the free throw line when he played, but uh, he's rectified those. McLovin and Dougie Fresh are going to shoot free throws, uh, shoot 10 free throws, and loser has to go into the fountain here at DirecTV. I, I knew a little minimum kindness. When I walked in yesterday, it was very early, about 4.05 a.m. I know the camera guys here. I've met them before many times, but I walk in, I give them a quick handshake, how you doing? And then I may not speak to them for the next few hours because we're working. So I try to get that hello checked off be a polite but start minimum the day. kindness minimum kindness but you're not saying something to them where you go hey how's the family no because I, I don't care how their family yeah. is yeah i don't <laughs> i don't know these guys they barely have an apartment more, more like they don't have a family wow i would just like to how's it going wow. good to see you that's, that's nobody here has a family that's yeah. really minimum kindness Couldn't there <laughs> Oh, Doug, no! Oh, God! Put Doug in the fountain? No! <laughs> Doug, I think we have to do the baptismal here. So let's not get a Take off your microphone. Oh, man. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> yes. Well done. Well done. Tune in to The Dan Patrick Show, weekday mornings on Audience or the DP Show app.